How about force measurement that is easy to integrate and independent of the force range? Strain sensors can be the suitable solution in this case. If a force acts on an object, the object experiences a change in length that is proportionate to the force. The force is dependent on the cross-sectional area of the object as well as its material. Therefore, a larger cross-sectional area of the object requires more force for the same length change. With strain sensors, the length change can be measured simply and precisely. They are a clever alternative to force measurement with force sensors. A major advantage of the use of strain sensors for force measurement is their easy mounting in the direction of the applied force. The sensor can be integrated easily into existing machines without great effort or machine modification. This facilitates the retrofitting of existing machines. Another advantage is the fact that a single strain sensor can cover several machine types with different force ranges. Despite the different forces, strain is almost always equal due to the larger cross-sectional area of the machine frame. What is more, when it comes to forces of over 10,000 Newton in particular, strain sensors are a more cost-efficient solution compared to force sensors, compact, commercially beneficial, standard sensors can be used. The alternative are force sensors. These are especially useful when it comes to measuring smaller forces. They are installed directly in the force flow of machines. This way, the process force can be measured very precisely. With its extensive portfolio for the measurement of forces, Balmer offers a suitable solution for all force ranges and machine structures with force and strain sensors. Mm -hmm.